What's up guys, Express here, back with another tutorial. Now this time we're not in Photoshop or any Adobe program, we're in DaVinci Resolve. I got a lot of requests of how I make my um, gradients. So that's what I did. I, I made a tutorial on how I make my gradient. And yeah, let's just start. This is gonna be quick, uh, easy tutorial to follow along. If you haven't ever used this program, I'll go slow. You can also um, pause the video, rewatch the video. So yeah, what you want to do is, of course, once you open it, you will have something like this. And um, then you want to go to this little edit button. That means you can edit anything. Then you go to effects, fusion, composition, and put that in your composition. Then you want to go to this little magic wand tool, and that's your fusion editor. What you want to do, of course, you have, you have this little um, icon. I don't know how it's called. I'm really in, um, called fast noise, I guess. Put that in and this is basically where you make your gradient. It's really easy. Also, you take this and you put it at the output and then you'll see what it will look like uh, at the end. First, we want to change our colors. Now we have two colors, black and white, but we want to make sure that's a gradient. And how I actually have those nice gradients always is I go to the site uh, colors.co. That is where I get most of my gradients as well. And uh, you can start to generate and then you have a nice purple. A looking color and then I go back into DaVinci I click on the first one and then I click on the first color uh, code on colors.co and I put that in there like so and then I make another one just click in the gradient and I automatically put another um, gradient color in there copy the color paste it in there and then I do that for the rest of the colors and um, what we want to do then is of course edit it a bit because if I press play now it will look like nothing is happening and that's not what we want uh, what we want of course is we have a bit less of a detail in my opinion and a bit more of contrast a bit more something like that and a bit more brightness as well and then the scale i want to zoom in so i want to have like on a 0 0.1 or something like that and then you want the the the, the seed rate or like how fast we wanted the the grain you wanted to go uh, not too fast something like that and then if you press play you'll have a smooth gradient um, yeah gradient it's kind of soothing but you know uh, what I want is of course I want to make the fusion a bit longer I want to go back in there I uh, want to maybe pop up the contrast a bit more and the details a bit more as well maybe and then the scale a bit zoomed out okay um, and I'm gonna play it again let's see how it looks and there you go um, it will look something like that um, if you want it fast of course you can always make it a bit faster maybe like something like that maybe a bit faster is a bit better but yeah you can play with these settings see how it looks and then of course um, put it in your project and then you go back to this little editing tab and then of course you can make it as long as you want and of course you can play it in its full length make it even longer and uh, yeah so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, um, get a 70 likes, I'll post them on my pay hip for free, and I'll see you guys next time, peace.